Good morning, WHS. Today is Friday, March 23rd, 2018. Good morning, Eagles. Welcome to Blue Eagle News. Information for the students, by the students. I'm Jared Kaufman. And I'm Audrey Saladin. Great job making it through the SATs and PSATs. Now we can take a breather. But if you're scheduled to take the SATs in May and you want to continue to improve, then you may want to sign up for the SAT prep class being held right here at WHS beginning next week, March 27th. This five-week course includes helpful insights and strategies that will help improve your math and verbal scores. Enrollment forms can be found in the Adult Education Office, room 211. See Mr. Jensen or Mr. Nicholas for any details. March is National Youth Art Month. WHS students are featured in two exhibits during this month. Selections from WHS Art Department are on display at the Weatherstool Public Library from March 3rd through April 13th. The National Art Honor Society members exhibit will be on display in the Weatherstool High School Art Gallery from March 9th through April 13th. There will also be a reception on Wednesday, March 28th from 5 to 7 p.m. Come down to the gallery and see the exhibit. Up next, Fatima is with us talking about Kahenda Wiley. New York-based painter Kahenda Wiley is best known for his large, vibrant, highly patterned, heroic portraits. Initially, the paintings were based on photographs taken of young men found on the streets of Harlem. As his practice grew, his eyes led him towards an international view, including models found in urban landscapes throughout the world. Painted in realistic style, Wiley makes references to old master paintings. The poses and objects in the portraits are based well-known images of powerful figures drawn from the 17th through 19th century Western art. President Obama chose Kahinda Wiley to paint his portrait for the National Portrait Gallery in Washington, D.C. The portrait has caused a lot of aesthetic discussion and brought out a lot of opinions. What do you think? If you have received an invitation to join the National Honor Society, be sure to meet Mrs. T in the auditorium on Friday, March 23rd, right after school. This meeting is mandatory and you will be receiving all of the materials needed to apply. Wednesday, March 28th, the English National Honor Society is hosting a Drop Everything and Read during the advisory period. Please remember to bring something to read. The advisory with the highest participation will be given a prize. Seniors, graduation is currently set for June 22nd. That's only 98 more days. There are many scholarship applications and information available to the class of 2018 in the school counseling office and online. Superintendent Mr. Michael Emmett pleads with seniors to apply. We're here today with Mr. Emmett. Who's clearly frustrated. A few moments later. Seniors, we need you to be filling out those applications for scholarships. It's free money. Free money. I'm looking at some of these schools and they're expensive schools to go to. You've got to be applying for those scholarships. It's free money. Free. Free. Seriously, Mr. Emmett, look at the scholarship bin. One eternity later. Wait, so why are we here, Mr. Emmett? Because we've got scholarship applications right here. Every time you come into guidance, here they are. Pick them out. Look and see if they apply to you. And then get busy applying. Apply today. 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 Up next, here's Lucas with sports. Congratulations to the boys swim and dive team who were recognized for the success at the AquaTurf on March 20th. The following students were recognized. Caleb Skoranek, Haddon Gaunt, Holden Hoon, Blake Fulton, and Austin Bavino. Anyone wanting to try out for the Weathersfield High School cheer team should plan on attending an information meeting on March 28th at 3 o'clock at SDMS. Tryouts are scheduled for April 26th at 3 p.m. in Gym B here at the high school. Back to you. Thanks, Lucas. Up next, the Spanish National Honor Society wants to share a little bit about their partnership with the Pulsera Project. Hey, hi, we're from the Spanish National Honor Society, and we're selling bracelets and bags to help support education and employment in Nicaragua. 
The bracelets are five dollars each, and the black bags are ten dollars each. We will be selling during lunch waves next week, Monday through Thursday, so that's March 26th through 29th. We will have a table set up in the CAF or see any SNHS member if you're interested. We also are, uh, appreciate donations. Um, see the next video, this really cool video that explains what the sale is all about. Thank you. The Pulsera Project is a fair trade nonprofit organization that works with artisans in Nicaragua and Guatemala and provides a market for their handmade bracelets, or pulseras, in schools across the U.S. Each pulsera costs only $5 and comes tagged with the photo and the signature of the artist who made it. Money raised from your school's pulsera sale will sustain employment for nearly 200 artisans and will also fund housing, healthcare, scholarships, social enterprises, and other empowerment programs that benefit the artists and communities throughout Central America. Thank you so much for your support and have an amazing time coloring the world with the Pulsera Project in your school. Community service hours are available to those who need them for the Taste of Weathersfield on Saturday, April 7th. There are two shifts available, 5.45 to 7.30 and 7.15 to 9. Please see Mrs. Zalagi. Hartford's largest college fair is next week, March 28th to the 29th. Any student interested in going to college should check out this fair. Go to nacacfairs.org for details. Junior Pum will be held at the Glastonbury Country Club on Saturday, April 28th. Tickets will be on sale during the week of March 26th after school in room 506. Make sure your class dues are up to date and bring your completed permission slips. Tickets will be $60. If you didn't get a chance to see the full announcements, you can check us out on Facebook and Twitter at Bleagle TV. And now you can find us on Instagram at Bleagle TV 411. And as always, you can visit the Blue Eagle webpage at tinyurl.com slash Blue Eagle TV. Be sure to pay attention to the digital bulletins for things you should know about clubs, activities, and other important information. If you have an announcement or recognition that you would like to share with our WHS family, please email misscoco at scoco at weatherskill.me or Blue Eagle News at blueeagles at weatherskill.me. Have a great day. See you next time.